Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It has been almost a year. I wanted to make this video because I am moving to school in 20-ish days. I'm gonna be a sophomore at Arizona State, so I'm really excited I have like a new apartment and everything. This video is gonna be kind of like getting my life together. If I don't have a good routine when I'm home, I'm definitely not gonna have a good routine at school. Today is July 12th and I move in August 4th, so a little over 20 days and I have a lot to do. I don't even like remember like when did I start packing? Last year I literally don't remember but as you just saw I just cleaned my room neatened up my room I thought I would start with that I already feel a lot more motivated today I have a couple things I want to do I want to go to the gym I'm gonna go tanning I have to email a couple things relating to like jobs on campus because I'm trying to figure that out I kind of want to organize my closet take out any clothes I don't want so down you know in a week or two packing is a lot easier for me Let's see what we're doing throughout the day I wanted to do it's like a quick little makeup ish so I don't look disgusting I'm gonna do that and then we're going to head to the gym I've been using these clips from Shein and I'm obsessed with them I know you guys have seen these everywhere but I'm just like obsessed with them all right I'm gonna put on some YouTube I got this new phone case from TJ Maxx and it's so cute I'm just going in with the Olay moisturizer nothing has changed I need to show you guys this. This from Soap and Glory just makes your skin like super glowy. It just looks so good under like concealer or foundation or anything. That is like the makeup look I've been going for is just like dewy and shiny. Some concealer. And I go conceal that fat pimple on my lip. What's um? Why am I getting pimples on my lip? Oh my god, this is I forgot to put it on, but milk like a refreshing thing for your under eyes makes your sealer like not crease. Contour a little bit. I know I'm going to the gym, but like I don't want to look gross this whole video. So and then I'm gonna do some air spun pa I don't know why I'm making a tutorial. <laughs> Then I'm using the NYX Glue Brow. I'm obsessed with this. It's my favorite brow product ever. And then I'm using the Cha Cha Tint Benefit Blush. And then I put a little bit of the NYX Born to Glow Illuminator. That is it for, oh my goodness. And now I'm just going to put my hair in like a sleek low bun. I'm going to put in some argan oil into my roots just because my hair has been super dry. Then I'm just gonna put in some hairspray. This is literally the hairstyle I wear every single day. And now I'm just gonna go change and then we'll head to the gym. Got back from the gym. Made some avocado toast with feta. I'm actually out of breath from walking up the stairs. I'm just gonna watch some YouTube because I'm like kind of dead from the gym. But I'm going to wait till tonight to shower. I know it's gross, but. I think I'm gonna go swimming later, so. Quickly, I just wanted to show you guys kind of like a little self-care haul that I got. I just wanna get into a good self-care routine before I go back to school, you know. So I can just feel my best. So I just got these nose strips, you know, for like blackheads or whatever. Got some new shampoo and conditioner because I got Olaplex once shampoo and conditioner, but like, it's just so expensive and I didn't feel like buying it again. So I got this Verb shampoo and conditioner and I use their dry shampoo and it's actually really nice. It smells really good, so. Then I got two things from the Bad Habit skincare line. Got the facial oil, which smells so good. I used this last night. It smells so good. A little nervous because I used these last night and I'm scared that it caused me to break out, but I'll use them a couple more times and see. Got the Total Reboot um, Enzyme Peel and the packaging is so cute. And then I got this Birthday Cake Body Butter. Um, this stuff just makes your skin like so smooth. This is like a truly knockoff. And I just got some purple hair conditioner slash hair mask. I used this last night. Worked really, really good. So I'm excited for that. I'm probably gonna do this like once or twice a week. My mom got me two Olaplex things. She got me zero and three. So I guess this one is for kind of like repairing, um, you know, 
protecting your hair and I guess it's supposed to dry out your hair a lot so they said to do like number three with it. I think it's just like fun to kind of spend a lot of time on self-care and it just makes you feel like so much better. You know just like making yourself a priority and I'm excited to get more into that routine before I leave for school just so I can keep it going when I'm at school. So what I wanted to do next I have my planner here and then my notebook. I kind of just wanted to spend the next like half hour, hour just kind of like planning out all of my time before I leave for school. I got this planner from Walmart and I actually like am obsessed with it. It's my favorite planner I've ever had. I just really like the daily sections because you can do like time blocking because sometimes I like to do that if I have like a busy day or you can just like make a to-do list. I like how you kind of have like the option. I'm using that a lot and using like stickers because Look at these cute stickers I have. Like the stickers just like make it fun. Just looking back on like footage from last year and I filmed what I never uploaded like a packing with me for college. And I started packing like a good like 10 days before. And I'm getting my wisdom teeth out on Friday. So basically when I recover from that, it's gonna be about 15 days I think. I'm such a last minute person, but like this is not something you can pack for like the night before. Like so I wanted to show you guys, I've been kind of writing stuff down making lists and everything i made basically like a whole list of stuff to do one of my nails just fell off sadly really i made like a whole list of everything i want to get done and i have to do before i go back to school so just things like pay my first month's rent transfer my prescriptions make like a budget plan i really want to make a budget plan i really want to be better on spending money because it's bad I just emailed to schedule a job interview for somewhere at school, but it definitely made me realize how many things you kind of have to do before you move, so I'm glad I wrote everything down. So it is the next day, I just had some coffee and, and today I have a couple things to do. Um, I have a job interview at 4.30, which was kind of very last minute i have to kind of prepare for that today um i want to organize the shelves i built these shelves and i thought they were going to be way bigger than they are they're not but i thought i would put kind of like my everyday tops in there i just need some more room in my drawers and then me and my mom are going to yoga tonight at seven and i think i'm hanging out with my friends after so yeah so i just wanted to show you guys the deals my closet is like pretty organized right now. I did clean out a lot of it. So I decided to keep this rack for like new items that I haven't worn yet or just like some extra space. The only problem is this drawer that I can't even pull out, but I just kind of want to put my everyday tops in there and then keep kind of like my more fancier like going out tops. So my plan is to put the shelves under this clothing rack. 22 days till I move and hopefully I secure a job today for when I go back and don't even comment on the pimple. I can't. I can't. I think I've come to the conclusion that the bad habit stuff really broke up my skin but I also have extremely sensitive skin. So I'm basically just going to put all the shirts from that drawer on my bed and go at organizing. I'm going to just divide these between like everyday basics okay. and then you know going yes, out party talks. I decided to put the party tops in the shelves. Why am I saying party tops? Like my going out, like you know what I mean. In the shelves because I have way too many basic tops. And I feel like if I always rummage through the shelves, they're gonna get messy, but there's just a quicker way to organize. I know I'm like literally leaving, so it makes no sense, but it just makes sense in my head and I think it'll be easier for me when I'm packing as well, so. Okay, so I pretty much have all, a lot of black shirts, so I'm putting all of them in this top row and then I'm just gonna go down by kind of shirt type and color. I actually hold like about four shirts each, so pretty good. I'm gonna Hi guys, so it is much later now. It's around 5 o'clock. I just wanted to update you guys on something. So I got a job for the fall, so I'm really excited. I just had the call and the interview thingy. Yeah, I got the job, so I'm really excited so I can 
stop applying to so many and it's the day I'm just going to yoga and then hanging out with friends so I thought I'd end the video here yeah I'm really excited to be posting this and making more videos I really want to try my best to upload them so yeah I will be see you guys soon in a new video kind of on my journey to moving back to school for my sophomore year and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video and leave a comment down below when you're moving to school bye guys